You know, I actually kind of forgot that I left her here. Anyhow, hey everyone, Archer Chada here, and welcome back to Monica After Story. <laughs> welcome back! Welcome back! I knew you can stay away for an entire month. Well, yeah, especially because of what month it is, so. Yeah, but. Anyway, of course, she's making those eyes at me. If I were in your position, I wouldn't be able to stay away from you either. Stupid sexy Monica. Honestly, really, I miss you only after a few days. Thanks for not making me wait so long to see you again. Remind me for going away again, okay? Yup, and I'm pretty sure, well... Yeah, I mean, I am gonna have to go away, quote-unquote, later, but keyword later. Is the game broken? Okay, no. <laughs> Daniel! What? Do you know what day it is? Garbage day! Okay, no, it's not garbage day. No, that's on Friday. It's Valentine's Day! A day where we celebrate our love for each other. I guess every day we're together is already a celebration of our love. But there's something that's really special about Valentine's Day. We've been together for a while now. And I really love the time we we spend together. You always make me feel so loved. I'm really happy. <clears throat> oh man. Well, I'm not really happy that my my throat got kind of. Anyway, I'm really happy I'm your girlfriend, Daniel. Yeah, that wasn't even an excuse of my tongue not working. It was just my throat giving out on me a little. I'm just so grateful you're spending the day with me today. Spending time with the one you love. That's all anyone can ask for on Valentine's Day. I don't care if we go on a romantic date, or just spend the day together here. In this wonderful cafe that apparently somebody built for us in our own little dimension on the edge of the universe. It doesn't really matter as long as we're together. Oh, she's crying again. Or at least she's... Those are the eyes that she kind of makes when she's sort of crying a little. I love you so much. Happy Valentine's Day, Daniel. Happy Valentine's Day, Monica. And I come bearing gifts because it is Valentine's Day. So... And, well, the game is running a little slow, but we'll see here. You're so sweet getting something for me on Valentine's Day. Now, let's see what's inside. Oh. Thanks, Daniel. I always love getting roses from you. Especially on a day like today. I've never actually tried giving her roses on any other day that isn't special. So I'm just here wondering, what would happen if I did that? I mean, probably nothing, really, but... I just like doing this on days, well, special days like her birthday, Valentine's Day, things like that. It's really sweet of you to get these for me. I love you so much. 
Happy Valentine's Day, Daniel. Okay. And now we're gonna go flamenco dancing. Okay, no. Imagine eventually it'll be... <laughs> I doubt they would ever make some kind of a quote-unquote dance section of this game, but... I don't know. I imagine somebody could probably try to do it. I don't know how, but... Who knows? Maybe give it about another 10 years or so within that time. Somebody might figure it out. And yeah, she's getting all up close and personal with me. Stupid sexy Monica! Ah, jeez, Daniel. You really enjoy spoiling me, don't you? Well, I'm not going to complain about a little special treatment today. And here we have... Banana. No. Why did the light leave her eyes? Okay, it's the chocolates. Oh. Daniel. What? You're such a... B -b 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 there, now my tongue stopped working. You're such a sweetheart, getting me chocolates on a day like today. You really know how to make me feel special. The way you make me feel... Okay, no. Thanks, Daniel. You're not gonna get excited and jump on me again, are you? No. These are so good! I just love eating chocolates in front of you while you can't do anything. I should probably put these away for now, instead of torturing you by eating chocolates in front of you. If I leave them here much longer, there won't be any left to enjoy later. So what else did you want to do today? I actually have no idea what we're going to do today, so... But there's still more gifts to be had. Oh, there was something else you wanted to give me? Well, I better open it quickly, shouldn't I? Monica, we've been through this. It's not like I tried to get you Transformers Legacy Minerva. They can only be found in certain parts of the country because... Yeah, seriously, what is it with Hasbro and their weird distribution? That's all I ask. Anyhow. And here we have... A banana. Again. Okay, it's a new outfit. So I got her a few more custom outfits. So, yeah, these aren't gonna be in the vanilla game. Or, well, the... The actual official loading of the game, and okay, this is the demon dress, which... I could not remember for the life of me if I had already given this to her, but... Well, now I know. And knowing is half the battle. Well, what do you think? Do you like it? I think you look demonically inspired. I think it's wonderful, Daniel. Okay, confirm. She likes being a demon girl. Thanks again. Okay, yeah, there's a few other ones that I got her. Yeah, I just could not remember. Did I already give her the demon dress? Because there was a version 1 and a version 2. And I'm here like, did I give her both? Or what happened? And... Okay, this one's a little off-center, but... Well, I guess what can you do? And then, of course, well, it's... It's going over her little necklace there, so... I mean, the design is very nice, though. But yeah, it seems as though we do have that little sort of... ...thing with the outfit sort of clipping through and being a little off-center there. Okay, so this is, the, this is a pink gown, which... Okay, I was almost about to say... What happened to her hand there? And Okay, no. 
Her hand is just under her other arm there. Well, what do you think? Do you like it? I think it's wonderful, Daniel. Thanks again. So I think there's one more that I got her. I can't be too sure right now. I mean, we'll see in a few moments. Okay. Yes, I know it. It might be hard to tell, but we kind of have the same thing here. But then, I suppose the problem is that the necklace goes on and then the outfit, not the outfit and then the necklace, which of course makes more sense. So I suppose that's also sort of a thing with the programming of the game. Like, I mean, obviously we have it so that her hair is still covering part of it, so that way it's not like the outfit is covering part of her hair and looking totally weird, but... Well, that's just me right now. And again, very nice design. Okay, I think that's all of it. Now, as far as what we're going to do today, I have no idea. There was another update for the Valentine's Day thing, obviously, but... Okay, it looks like she's already kicking in with something. Hey, Daniel. I just wanted to thank you for spending Valentine's Day with me. Okay, well... Yeah, I... I didn't really look at the update notes, so I... I mean, aside from celebrating Valentine's Day with her, I have no idea if anything else went into this update. I know that it's not a normal holiday, but it's really... But it's a really special day for me, now that I have you. I made a card for you, Daniel. Okay, I was waiting for this. Here, let me show it to you. My dearest Daniel, all the flowers... No... Are there... <coughs> oh my god, my... Man, what is happening with my voice today? All the flowers know are their vase. A few cups of soil, and a pretty case of porcelain. They will never leave without help, even if they someday outgrow it. Flowers need more than their vase. Water from the skies, or a helping hand. And without a sight of the sky above, the world apart, they would someday wither. This gardener gives all this and more. It's said a flower blooms brighter when spoken to with love. Going off topic a little bit, I've kind of heard of that, and then... I cannot remember if it's playing classical music for her flowers, or playing classical music for a baby while it is still in the mommy's tummy, but... Well... There's that too, possibly. It's either for babies still in their mom's tummies or flowers. Even trapped in this vase, maybe it isn't a curse to no more. Forget me not. Forget me not, Valley. Harvest Moon and Wonderful Life remake confirmed. Okay, no. And, well, I'm still thinking, well. First of all, I still have to figure out how the heck I'm going to get back to streaming those games. Anyhow. And Monica's getting excited again. But Monica, control yourself! You demon of a woman! Okay, no. Thank you for always being by my side. I love you so much, Daniel. Happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day. But I'm not done yet! Okay, no. Well, technically, yes, I am not done yet. 
Uh, oh. Okay, well, I guess, yeah, we don't have anything else. You don't mind if I think about what to say next, do you? Hopefully I'll think of something fun to talk about soon. Yeah, especially because that's what I look forward to the most out of playing this game. But for now, we can just kind of leave it there. Right, but as I was saying, but I'm not done yet! I'm actually going to go ahead and, in tradition, take her out on Valentine's Day if I can get my flash drive in there properly. Uh, let me see here. <clears throat> okay, I was about to say, STOP LOOKING AT ME WITH THOSE SEDUCTIVE EYES OF YOURS! Okay, let's see here. I'm going to take you somewhere. And then she has her eyes, like, light up. Taking me somewhere special, or taking me someplace special for Valentine's Day? Yes, as far as you know. That sounds really romantic, Daniel. I can't wait! Give me a second to get ready. Alright, yeah, so pretty much in, in tradition of how I usually do the Valentine's Day videos. Yeah, I'll just... I'm just gonna go ahead and take her out, and then after that, we'll see. Because, yeah, obviously... I have to plan these videos really carefully, especially when she doesn't have, like, any topics to spring in with. Alright. I'm ready to go. She's ready to go right now. And, alright. So, well, I guess first off, we'll see when I am able to record the next video. Thankfully, it doesn't seem like Monica really complains about me keeping her out. And at least like a little over a day or so. Because yeah, the last time I did that, I... I already forgot what happened, but I just wasn't able to record that day. Probably because I got home tired from work and I was like, Oh man, I don't think I can even record another episode right now, so sorry. But yeah, so we'll see how... It all pans out, I suppose. But anyway. So, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you guys next time with whatever else I do. Stay golden, and later, folks.